there. So I built this tool to help streamers pick either suggestions from the audience or pick a random user of the audience. Uh, pretty much you have to open the app, you can pick a resolution here. In this case I'm going to pick this small resolution so you can see the chat while I do this. Uh, first thing you've got to do is to type in the channel name because that's how the bot knows which channel to watch for, for the suggestions or users. Uh, you can change the command, you can change the suggestion title, the object in this case, if I'm asking for ideas then the object's idea, and the objects, the plural of it is ideas, so it types right there. Uh, you can say how long you want to be receiving suggestions before picking, or you can do it manually by just clicking the button. In this case I'm going to say, I'm going to set a time here, just for an example. Uh, you can have different options here, you can either go and pick suggestion, you can vote for the suggestion, or you can pick a random user. In this case I'm going to start by showing the pick suggestion. So press start here, start receiving ideas and then type hashtag add. Uh, this is my cool idea. So I received one idea, I believe I, I allowed multiple so I'm going to say this is other cool idea. This is a bad idea. So I added some ideas there, if I stop receiving my ideas, which is going to happen soon, I can pick a random idea. So this is my cool idea was picked. If I pick another one, it's going to have removed that one, this other cool idea, because I clicked remove after picking. So I, after I picked each one of those, they were removed from the pool and now there's no, no other ideas in the pool. Uh, I did this by clicking removing after picking. You can remove this if you want to keep the ideas even after picking them or it can be a, a game suggestion can be many things whatever you want you can also uh, have a vote on the options or ideas or whatever you can type a starting options with a comma so in this case I put like a I want to decide between play don't starve or terraria so I wrote them both down with a comma separating them I'm gonna say this is a game and this is games and vote on the next game all right, I'm gonna say remove after picking. Yep. Uh, I can say allow multiple entries if one user can vote, like can add multiple things. So in this case, start receiving games. I have two games there. I'm gonna add a new one. I'm gonna say add uh, Minecraft. So my name ap appears there because I added something. Stop receiving. We can vote now. So we can either vote on Don't Starve, Terraria, or Minecraft. If I don't like one of those, I can say remove vote, just the channel owner can say that. Remove vote 2, now the, you can only vote between Terraria and Don't Starve. I'm going to say vote 1 to vote for Terraria. I received a vote. Whenever the vote ends, the one that received the most votes is going to win. Terraria won, yay! And pick user, it's useful for giveaways. Let's say I pick me. I like pick me. I'm going to put only 12 seconds. Uh, start viewers, if someone says pick me, they're gonna be entered. You can actually stop manually too by clicking on stop. Whenever you want to pick the user, you can click pick random user and goes and passes through all the users and picks one. In this case, only me because I'm only the one testing this. Alright, so this is how you use this tool. I hope this is helpful for someone. And yeah, thanks for watching.